Here we'll use the dir function to tell us about the methods and attributes of an object. So I'm going to switch back to that file we created before, patient underscore v1.py. So this created three attributes, name, age, malady, and also had this display method within the class of patient. We previously saved that. I'll go ahead and run that. And before we created a patient called Madonna, let's do that again. And then we assign to Madonna the name given by the string Madonna. We had a Madonna age attribute of 54. And Madonna's malady was a yellow belly. We'll stick with that. And we saw before, if we say Madonna, put this dot as the access attribute operator, and then say call your display method, and we need the parentheses there to indicate this is a method, we see the name, age, and malady displayed in accordance to the display method. Now, if we want to learn a bit more about this object, we can use the built-in function dir and provide it the argument of whatever object we're interested in, Madonna here. And this provides a list, and we'll talk about lists later on, of strings corresponding to all the methods and attributes in the object. And we see there are a whole lot of things here. Notice that at the end of the list are age, display, malady, and name. Those are things that we put into the class statement for the patient class. Now all these other things in this list, they start with a double underscore and end with a double underscore. Those are things that Python provides for us. And we'll ignore most of these, but in a subsequent video we'll actually go and see what one of these is useful for. The one that's double underscore init double underscore. For now, let's just inspect a little bit more closely some of the things that we've put in this Madonna object. So let's use the type function, provide to it an argument of Madonna.age, and we're told that that's an int, an integer. Or how about type function, tell us what the type is for Madonna.display, and we're told that that's a method. And one more thing, let's go with type Madonna dot malady. That's a string. So we'll leave it at that, but you should keep in mind that when you're working in the interactive environment, this dir function, sort of like the help function, can be useful in reminding you what's available for you to use.